Advanced Gold, the news recently. Advanced Gold trades as AAX in the Toronto Venture Exchange. So they have some nice gold, zinc, lead, and silver intersects with the Tapasquina Project in Zacatecas, Mexico. With me now, CEO Alan Barry Labacam. Okay, Al, thanks for the time. This one got you halted. Let's run through the highlights. Yeah, we um, we announced that uh, we hit 1.25 meters of 5% zinc, 2.79% lead, and 12 grams of gold arc silver at our Tabasquena project in uh, Zacatecas, Mexico. This is from our, uh, what I think is our best hole, and why I say that is we've been able to tag, we have this big geophysical anomaly that's about 3,200 meters, and uh, we had to find out, how, you know, how to tackle such a big beast. So we went we, we went to the southern part where it comes close to the surface and we hit a new package of rock, a black slate. And, uh, and, and in that we had the most amount of sulfides to date. And in that we hit this high grade uh, intersection. Now we're on our, now we're awaiting the results from drill hole 14, which was a hundred meter step out along the geophysical anomaly north of the uh, AGT-13. And in addition to putting that uh, the assay results out, I also included uh, drill hole plan maps so people could just see how far of a step out we've made uh, from, it's about a 3,000 meter step out from where our past drilling is. And now we've hit this uh, new package of rock uh, on a geophysical anomaly that goes that far. Then I also added in there a series of drill hole, drill core, so that people could see what what we're now looking for. It's going from this fine grained uh, sulfides way out at the extent of the, the the anomaly. Now we're moving closer to it, and we're hitting more sulfides over over thicker uh, intervals. So. We're heading in the right direction. We've got the right tool in the geophysics to be able to lead us in that direction. And uh, all of this makes for an exciting discovery and, you know, one I think investors want to keep their eye on. And how's the CV-19 affected uh, your operations over there? Uh, sounds like you shut down for a month. Yeah, we um, will be shut down for, till, well, uh, as it is right now, they've said till the end of April. Um, there's a, uh, a union uh, of miners here in uh, Zacatecas because about 10,000 families are affected by this shutdown. And so they're making their case that, you know, it shouldn't last this long, you know, if, uh, if, uh, if they're out there, you know, where it's not that, um, you know, not such a concentration of people you know, and you're using equipment, well, you know, maybe we should let some of this continue. So there will be a back and forth. And I, my guess is that it'll probably get uh, lifted before the end of um, uh, April. But even at that, I mean, it's 28 days from now, we can uh, get all of our drill core and all of our data together and uh, get ready for our next round of drilling. 